Good evening. Governor Kristi Noem was on Capitol Hill today testifying before a House committee about her opposition to a new rule being proposed by the Federal Bureau of Land Management. The agency is proposing placing conservation of millions of acres of public lands under the agency's control on equal footing with uses such as grazing, mining and recreation. But as Cabo Lands Perry Groton reports tonight, Noam told members of the House Committee on Natural Resources that such a rule is unnecessary and even harmful. Governor Noam served on the House Natural Resources Committee during her time in Congress and told her former colleagues that a proposed rule giving the Bureau of Land Management more authority in promoting conservation on public lands is a case of government overreach. And what's interesting to me is watching how they allow bureaucrats in D.C. to make these decisions under this proposed rule and taking that authority away from the local BLM offices. Noam says South Dakota ranchers have an economic stake in managing public lands they lease for grazing, something she says that could be undermined by the Bureau of Land Management. They ignore stewardship practices that have been practiced on our land for generations. Uh, while allowing multiple uses of this uh, precious resource to strengthen America and our people. The Bureau of Land Management says the proposed rule will ensure that public lands people use to hunt, fish and hike will remain healthy and resilient for generations to come. The agency says this rule will also help to respond to climate change, increasing drought, a loss of wildlife and an influx of invasive species. Perry Groton, Hello Land News. You can take a closer look into the public lands rule and why the Bureau of Land Management says that it won't threaten ranching operations by going to this story on kettleland.com.